Hey gents, checking in from the road, I wanted to do a quick video update on my Allbirds. I unboxed these a couple of months ago and just this morning I hit my 250th mile run in these shoes and I think that's a perfectly good time to uh, check these out. I'll put a link to these below, I don't have the affiliate link, it's just uh, a cool brand that I picked up that you guys had recommended and I'm really happy that I did. If you have not seen my Allbirds unboxing video, Allbirds is a 100% merino wool upper right here. You have a very lightweight sole included in this which makes them great for travel. You may think when you hear merino wool that you're thinking of like a thick uh, wool sweater, but that's really not the case anymore. Uh, merino wool is very fine, it's very lightweight, it has a lot of uh, very cool technical properties to it like moisture wicking, breathability, um, cooling and heating and I mean even this Henley right here is from the company Wooly. I'll put a link to them below and uh, it's one of my favorite shirts. They've, they sent uh, uh, a long sleeve Henley, a short sleeve Henley, a v-neck and, and even some of their underwear and uh, merino, merino wool underwear is even something that uh, I never really thought would be a thing but it's but it's so smooth, so soft and so uh, all birds are another case of this where it's, it's wool but but it's it's this new era of wool and I think that's really cool they're incredibly comfortable as a casual shoe so they have really good support just for wearing every day you're not required to wear socks either because the merino wool is naturally moisture wicking it has you know it's very breathable and uh, I don't have experience wearing these in warmer climates in summer months yet but uh, so far they've been really great for running I'd use these more exclusively for uh, my morning runs and I you know I typically go out in cooler weather I do wear socks with these I do not recommend uh, one of the very first times that I wore these I went for a six mile run with no socks on and I came back with just about the worst blister that I ever had in my life on the uh, arch of my foot so if you're going to run with these for more than a few miles definitely wear socks but if you're wearing these out as a casual shoe or you're going for um, a longer walk or just kind of wearing them casually you do not need to wear socks at the same time that I bought my pair I, I got a pair for my wife as well she rarely ever wears these with socks and she, it has been great so far one of the things that she has had is the insole has been pilling on her uh, you can buy additional insoles on here I have not had that problem I don't know if it's because she ends up uh, wearing them more than I do versus me, me just mostly wearing them for running and so that is uh, that's that's one data point I've had no problems she's had some problems with it but even then even if she wears socks with the pilling you can't really tell overall they've held up extremely well there's no real separation between the upper and the sole which is a good sign I have not washed these yet these are machine washable you can throw them in the washing machine and just clean them but I have not needed to do that yet even with my 250 miles run there's absolutely no smell to these. Um, like I said, they're great for travel. They, you can't really tell they're in your suitcase. They don't take up a lot of space because you can really, uh, if you get the two shoes here together, you can really cram them down and uh, fit them in pretty well. So I really like to take these with me on the road. If you have any questions, comment below. I'll make sure I answer those. Um, you know, the laces hold up well. I uh, really don't have a, anything negative to say and and when it comes to running shoes I used to run in uh, some Asics and I've had a pair of Brooks in the past you know the gel quantum Asics they're like $140 and so these at 95 is a great deal now uh, like I said 250 miles with these still looking pretty good if I do end up running a marathon this year it is likely that I will run in these and then that will be about 500 miles between the training between what I've run now the training and the actual marathon uh, I might end up doing more than 500 miles in these this year which is about you know that's that's the top of the limit that you want to have with these shoes and so I really like I said really like these as casual shoes I think they look very um, subtle and and classic whenever you wear these they're not uh, calling attention to themselves M most people you know uh, they, they look nice and clean so they're a really nice casual shoe and uh, if you want to run in these then uh, you're all set there as well they just put out a white pair that I really like and uh, those might be the ones that I pick up next so like I said if you have any questions comment below um, big fan of these shoes this is an endorsed sponsor or anything else this is just uh, me sharing my thoughts on these shoes overall there you have it, gents, getting back in the groove in the channel for this year. If you have any suggestions, comments, updates, uh, like, share, everything else with this video, appreciate all of your support. And until next time, gents, this is The Cavalier.